The circular economy in the automotive industry. Nature of the problem. Elevated fixed costs, overcapacity, and the presence of a few large incumbents controlling the market make the global automotive industry deeply rooted in the linear economic paradigm, the so-called take, make, waste model. Take, a number of raw materials are extracted from the earth to manufacture car components, but overall reserves of some key resources are rapidly approaching depletion. At current extraction rates, lead reserves will run out by half a century. Make, according to the golden rule of planned obsolescence, Car components have poor quality to secure fast replacement rates and overall short product lifespan. Waste. Car carcasses and components that are not recycled end up in landfills. Around the world, it is estimated that some 1.5 billion new tires are produced annually. Problem quantification. Because of the linear approach to doing business, Firms operating in the automotive sector are characterized by severe environmental impacts and major structural inefficiencies. Car usage is directly linked to air pollution, defined by the UNEP as the world's worst environmental health risk. In Europe alone, emissions from vehicles expose 90% of city residents to harmful air pollution levels. Approximately 20% of global emissions are linked to high energy intensive car manufacturing plants and petrol engines. The average car is parked more than 90% of its lifetime. Circular practices tackling the linear paradigm. Some industry leaders have already started to revolutionize the car industry. These pioneers include startups as well as established companies that are overturning their internal processes to deliver greener products and reduce their overall environmental footprint. 1. Design Circular pioneers are adopting new design principles to reinvent the way vehicles are manufactured. Car components are designed with modularity and upgradability in mind, so they can be easily replaced when brake or a newer version is released. Green design focuses on increasing the use of recycled materials in the manufacturing of the main body of cars. Design for prolonged use implies the adoption of innovative solutions to extend the life cycle of vehicles. 2. Use At the use phase, circular firms are tackling current rock-bottom utilization rates, offering car-sharing services to consumers. Car-sharing users are growing at breakneck speed and will reach 25 million in 2020, according to some estimates. 3. Reverse cycles. Circular economy oriented companies have invested in remanufacturing operations where car components get reintroduced in the production process. For example, waste generation rates in state of the art remanufacturing plants have reached an astonishing 0%, with all components being either reused, recycled, or valorized in treatment centers. By doing so, the need for virgin materials is significantly reduced. Business and policy advice. Recommendations for business. Business seeking to evolve should engage circular economy specialized consultants and participate in relevant industry initiatives to understand how circular principles can best apply to their unique realities. And later, start piloting small scale circular projects before gradually embedding circular principles more broadly across their organizations, hence adopting a learn-by-doing attitude. Recommendations to governments. In order to help circular innovations become the new backbone of the industry, governments should adopt CE-oriented legislations, such as tax breaks or incentives for car-sharing practices, assist firms wanting to embrace circular principles by setting up dedicated groups of consultants, experts, and researchers. Educate consumers through conferences, workshops, and other initiatives on the benefit of the circular economy.